Good morning, traders. John Caruso coming to you here from RJO Futures. Today is Friday, June 15th. Uh, here to give you the opening comments in regards to the currency markets. Uh, first, we'll take a look at the uh, numbers that we have seen come out so far. We did see New York manufacturing come out under expectations at 2.29. Uh, that is under expectations of, uh, of a reading of about 5% here. Um, is what the market was looking for. So we are seeing some more signs of deflation. Uh, that number coupled with yesterday's CPI number, uh, that does certainly leave the door open for central bank activity at uh, the upcoming FOMC meeting. Uh, we do have the dollar under a little bit of pressure right now, sitting at uh, 82.20, uh, which has it down about 14 points so far on the day. We'll kind of recap yesterday's events. We did actually see the dollar for the better part of the day uh, hold its own. It, it was uh, relatively firm and then we did hear a rumor late in the day that uh, G20 central bankers are prepared to take a coordin uh, coordinated action uh, to help prop up uh, uh, global markets. So right now if you are long the U.S. dollar you are fight fighting an uphill battle. I know fundamentals certainly support a weaker euro currency uh, which would in turn uh, turn into a stronger dollar. Uh, but right now with uh, central bankers uh, talking uh, it does appear as if uh, we will get some more uh, quantitative easing or further stimulus from next week's uh, uh, FOMC report. So you are fighting an uphill battle right now if you are long the U.S. dollar. Um, taking a look uh, at the euro, euro right now uh, pretty much flat to higher, trading about uh, 126.20 or so. Uh, we do have resistance coming in at 126.74 uh, today. Uh, we do, of course, over the weekend have Greek, the Greek elections. So Sunday night, uh, be prepared. We will see a lot of turbulence in the marketplace. Uh, if you are looking at taking positions home, uh, certainly have a stop in place uh, and, uh, and have your eyes on the, uh, the open on uh, Sunday night. Uh, another foreign currency I'm looking at right now, I do kind of like to the upside, the Aussie dollar. Trade about 99.49 right now, uh, up 58 ticks. That is the strongest foreign currency we're seeing uh, right now at the moment. Uh, next resistance comes in up at 99.86. I would look at uh, a pullback to about that 99 level before maybe trying to test the upside in that market. So that's all I have for you today. Feel free to give me a call anytime, 800-669-5354. And remember, trading futures and options carries risk. It may not be suitable for all investors.